Noor Salman is facing two counts in connection to the attack at Pulse nightclub. The first, that she knew her husband, Omar Mateen, had become radicalized and aided his involvement with ISIS. The second, that she intentionally misled investigators the day of the murders. Inside the federal courthouse, Salman was sullen, head down, very soft-spoken when read her charges in connection to the June attack at Pulse nightclub, a venue popular among the gay community. The 30-year-old has been living in San Francisco for the past several months until her arrest yesterday by FBI agents, seven months after the deadliest mass shooting in modern U.S. history. The government believes it now has enough evidence to hold Salman responsible for the murder of 49 people and injuring more than 50 others. Accusations her uncle adamantly denies, telling us Salman was physically abused by Omar Mateen and she had no knowledge of her husband's plan of mass murder. I believe she's a victim. She is. She, she, all these years living under that kind of life. Um, I feel sorry for all these 50 people pass away, but the right person who did this crime, he need to pay for it. But not in, don't take it an innocent person. She have no idea. And one of the charges that someone faces is a crime of terrorism, and that involves a life sentence. She is currently being held without bail and is due back here in federal court tomorrow morning. But prosecutors do intend to prosecute Selman in Orlando. Live in Oakland, Vicki Gonzalez, back to you. All right, Vicki, thank you. A lot of news.